I'm about to end this man's whole career. So, I have updated my script just a bit more. So, um, it is now a best used tamper monkey or something like that. And just enable it. And then refresh the page so it actually shows up. Log into your account. Alright guys, and this is this is incredible what I've managed to do. This took forever to work out on so many hacky things in the code, but it totally works. So So um zeroing up, okay. Now here's something I'm gonna click avatar edit. Okay. And and, and it's right there. <laughs> it's right there. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Ta da Oh and that's not all. You can also um you can do this as well. Um, just set the real name to a blank space. I see save is disabled, but it doesn't matter because we can just click force save. And there you go, you've got a visible real name. Um, note you want to make sure no matter what you set something as the last name, even if it's just a blank space. Um, because if you just set the first name and don't set the last name, it will it's for your PS4 will throw an error when you go to your profile page. So, um, yeah. Um, and of course, if you want to remove it, you literally just remove everything and click for save. But there's another service this guy has. Um, look at this thing. You also can move your um, profile name. Um, and to do that, what you just do is you put a space in front. Or multiple if you want and then just force save and there you go now it won't show anything here but on the console it will be ahead okay even can you see if I click here it even shows it's saved like this right if you just save normally it wouldn't actually do that so see if I save normally and click on here again the um trailing spaces are gone so that's what you want to do um, so yeah, that's what I've done recently. Um, this was the coolest thing ever. There was one little bug where this is actually misaligned down here, but I don't think anyone really cares. Um, yeah, default avatar just shows up in the menu and you can select it. <sighs> so I have the um, link for this user script. You need, um, you need Tamper Monkey, which is, um, on the Chrome Web Store, um, you can just find it on there. Um, if you use Firefox, you can use um, Greasy Fork instead. And if it comes down to it, you can just copy paste the JavaScript into your URL with in front of it, and that will still work. So. If you don't have any other option, you can still do that. It won't still work. It just won't be anyone there as cool. So, yeah. <laughs> um, that's about it, though. Thanks for watching.